This is the PowerTube 30C from Nanlite. It is a powerful RGBWW LED tube with an adjustable color temperature from 2700 up to 6500 Kelvin, as well as a full spectrum of RGB colors and pre-programmed special lighting effects. With a CRI rating of over 95, this light is highly color accurate and the built-in battery will last for a little over 2 hours at full brightness. You have the option of 2.4 GHz wireless control and you can connect multiple tubes together via SYNC cord. So the question is... Is this tube any good? Well, here you have it. As usual as with Nanlite products, the PowerTube 30C comes in a very well-crafted and handy carrying bag. You also get a charging cable as well as a transparent mounting clamp that you can put on a ball head in order to use the PowerTube 30C on, for instance, a light stand or something like that. Now, you can buy a single tube, but they also offer bundle options and I went with the four light kit since I think this is quite a great value for the price you pay. I've used these four lights for a bit more than a year on productions like music clips, social media content, commercials and tutorial videos and I can say they're very versatile and can easily up your game, especially as a one-man show. Now in order to control this light you have two knobs and a bunch of buttons on the one side and the on-off switch on the other side. The menu button lets you cycle through various options being CCT, HSI, special effects, cycle, address for wireless settings, combined control for sync settings when using multiple tubes and finally battery, which is very handy since it tells you exactly the percentage of power you have left. In a CCT mode, you can use the tube as a light source anywhere between 2700 and 6500 Kelvin. The maximum light output is 2850 lumens for one tube and 2369 lux at one meter at 5600 Kelvin when you combine a kit of four tubes. In the HSI menu, you can basically change three values. The color, which is divided into 360 degrees, the saturation between 0 and 100% and finally the dim also between 0 and 100%. On a special effects mode, you have a variety of different presets like for example cop car or flash mode that you can customize by choosing different colors and even things like the duration of the strobo flash effect. The RGB cycle mode works together with the other modes. It gives you more options to fine tune these effects when it comes to color, cycle speed or flash duration. This is actually a pretty cool idea, even though it might be a bit counterintuitive since you have to basically set the mode in one menu and then fine tune it in another one. But after a couple minutes of trying out different modes, you'll easily see what's connected with what. Now what also really helps is that all the instructions are written on the back of the tube here. And I think that makes a lot of sense because who the hell keeps written instructions or manuals, right? Now, in order to test this tube, I basically just had to use it for myself. Instead of giving you one of these clinical reviews, I decided to shoot a short film using the PavaTube 30C as my main source of light. It was shot using the Sony A7S III together with a Siri 50mm f1.8 anamorphic lens. I left the colors straight out of camera, S-Log3 with the standard Sony LUT and sometimes maybe adjusted the exposure a little bit. So, this is what you can expect from the PavaTube 30C from Nanlite.
To come to a conclusion, the PavaTube 30C from Nanlite is one of those tools that makes a huge difference at a very affordable price. I own a fair share of lights, but oftentimes I end up using that lighting solution that is the fastest, most convenient and doesn't stand in the way of my creative process. And with the PavaTube 30C from Nanlite, I feel like the only limitation is your own imagination. Damn, that kinda camouflage a wrap. If you like this video, it would mean a lot to me if you leave a sub, like or a comment below. So keep creating and I see you guys in the next video. Cut!